Hello again, folks, and welcome back to Let's Play Metroid Prime. I'm your Dungeon Master Darius. Last we left off, uh, I had destroyed Mama Sh that thing. Just making sure that that's not a thing I can do. So. Now, what we are going to do, we are going to try to go around and try to find any and all of the purple doors, hello, that we might have missed. Also, I'm trying a relatively new setting for my microphone, and hopefully it's going to work. Alright, so that's where I fought the thing. That's the canyon. Ah. Purple door. Wait. Purple doors across from the. Ah, okay. It's fine. Less fine if I end up getting hit. Nope, seem to be fine. God, that feels badass. Just jumping through the air, then being all like, haha. Yes, 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 yes. I hear you, Missile Missile. More importantly, I hear you, Mr. Electrical Thing. What were they called again? I forget. Okay, no. I am heading the wrong direction. I was supposed to go up that way. I can read maps. No, I can't. I can't one bit. But, at the least... It's over there. So, it's just that higher bit up, up there. Hopefully I'm able to get up there just fine. I don't see why I wouldn't be able to. Should be able to just... Nope. Not double jump there. Double jump from here? Yeah. Sounds like a very angry shit off. Oh. Just gonna ignore you. Actually, I wanted to come back in this direction anyways, because this... was where Dang it. there we go Dang it. wait why did it switch targets ah. that's not what I meant to do but okay ah. come on I was about to say, I'm not out of missiles. I'm just out of patience. There we go. And see, now I need the missiles for dealing with those little pests. Yeah, now I can jump here. Get a little bit of health and energy back. Alright. God damn it. Come down here. Close enough. See, part of me just wants to use the power beam instead. There we go. Because using the power beam when swi when switching to missiles to the power beam. It doesn't need to do that little additional little animation, if that makes any sense. Hope it makes sense. Made sense to me. Alright. That's that door. Huh. You know, that's the first time I've actually seen this thing 
target something way off in the distance instead of something super close by. Might, be, might just be me. You know, one of those one in 50 things. Oh. I might have overkilled that a little bit. Alright, now the question is, where the hell is that sound coming from? Right, so we're not going to be able to get that one just yet. Might have been angry with that. On the plus side, Sucker's got way more um, range, as it were, so dealing with the parasites is a little bit easier. I see what I'm going to end up getting next, and I like it. Or, or do I? There's several times when this game has just up and said, Haha, you thought you were going to get that thing? No, no. You get this thing. At which point I just say, Wow, you a jerk. Okay, I probably have to activate some sort of power nodule. Let me double check. An active can be act yeah, okay. Hello. Something down there. There's something out on the wing. God, I I cannot describe how much I love double jumping in video games. It just feels so good. Oh wait. No, no, this is one of these ones. Yeah. I remember how some of this works. Keyword being some. Alright, so... Besides the annoying sound of things I probably can't get yet. Not sure what else there is to be doing here. Because that's not on. And those things are going to knock me off any platforms I find, huh? Heh, <laughs> well, joke's on them. I know the ability of destroy things that are walking in a certain path. Despite what my Elden Ring playthrough would lead you to believe. Don't think that's how that works. Okay. There's no... Where am I going? Oh! There's another one. Okay. You actually don't need to hold down the charge for very long in order to get it to work. There we go. Now we're thinking... Now we're thinking with more balls. And... I don't know why the hell they make it so as everything's activated by a bombs, but I digress. So this will raise the platforms. Aha! Whee! Oh, hell yeah! That's just what I needed. Alright. So I gotta do it again. This time, I uh, use the higher platform. Got it. Hey, water, physics. Hmm. Oh, unless okay, 
I get it, I get it. I don't have to use the other part of this whole situation. I just have to do this. Stinking cutscene. How dare you? This is valuable jumping over the water pits time. Or is it valuable walking over in this direction time? Man, I can't tell half the time. Because there's that one. But that's a large jump. There's this one, but it's not active. Hmm, I guess I'm going through the purple door. Actually, wait, no, that was... It's about the same distance. If I screw this one up... Eh. Eh. Hello, save point. Did you miss me? <laughs> I don't know why I'm flirting with the save point. Maybe because uh, it's kind of my only companion in this entire game. Alright. And... Bloop. There we go. Oh. Oh, you're bad. Hi. Shadow Pirate. Pirate forces trained and encrypted for stealth operations. Oh, I hate it. Select group of space pirates have access to sophisticated cloaking technology. This gear drains high levels of power, however, forcing them to rely solely on melee weapons in battle. Use enhanced detection gear. I don't have that. I guess I'll die. Or, consider, missiles. Missiles are also valid. Yep. Sure has been a malfunction there. Oh, I see you. I feel like I've been warned. Space pirates, sentient aggressor species, well trained in weapon and melee combat. They wield galvanic accelerator cannons and forearm mountain scythes in combat. Can I have one of those? I'd love one of those. This species seeks to become the dominant force in the galaxy, and their technology may help them realize this goal. Ruthless and amoral, the pirates care little for the cost of their ambition. Only the results matter, and they take these very seriously. It's a good thing they suck at dodging. They take perks. Oh, hello. That's not where I wanted to go. Ah, cool. We gotta go that way anyways, don't we? Okay. Ow. It kind of makes space pirates in this one be badasses. I mean, they were all kind of always badasses and prior games, being able to essentially deflect your weapons and whatnot. Ow. See, I called it. I knew it was there. But space pirates kind of stop that. I just wanted to walk up a platform, but they were all like, no. Samus Aran does not get to walk up a platform. 
Okay, if that's the direction we need to go, I want to go the direction I don't need to go first. Because Neener. Oh, hello. I'm glad I did. I better ingest this coffee before it gets too cold. Ah. Alright. So we essentially have two paths. One to this research core. And one to... That. Well. I'm going to tell you right now. I'm going to try to get to that other one. Just saying. Ah. Is it strange to say that despite some of the tenseness of some of the boss fights and whatnot, this game is rather relaxing. Might just be me. They got songs of anxiety and all that fun shit. Environments that make you go, mm, yep, I don't want to go this, do, do that whatsoever. And yet, here I am. Playing the thing that causes great anxiety in me. I'd almost say that would... Okay. Oh, that's a bad sound. Hi again, Space Pirate. Must be more in here somewhere. I can hear the battle music still. Oh, they might be on higher levels. Like jerks or something. Which is a shame, because I want to scan stuff. Euthanized. Oh, species 2 euthanized. I was a psychotic episode scheduled for removal. It must be after removal. Operational. Look at all this lore. Increased acidity levels reached in the phase on amniotic. Wait, amniotic bath. Oh no. This is likely a side effect of phase on ingestion. Increased volatility recorded, predator awareness ind indicated even in cold stasis. Oh, I know you're up there somewhere. Can't fool me. Did I just double jump up there? Oh, wait. Please step on the hologram for elevator. Uh-huh. Just a good old one-two combo. It's a good combo. Can I do it? I very much like to have a little bit more health now. He says with full, four full things of it. There's something in that one. Let's see. Codec casing of column appeared weak. No? Alright. Optimal absorption mutation has led to unexpected degeneration of internal organs. Shows mandible mutation across all subjects. Cross infusion with batch 1622.g recommended. Is it strange to say that the G actually reminded me of another game I wanted to let's play? Oh, new data. Research outpost Glacier 1 in the Predrona Ring. 
Driffs region of Talon Forest Mountains is operating at 85% capacity. Sub-zero temperatures, sub temperatures have made the Metroid sluggish uh, and it is easy to control, even those well into phase on infusion cycles. Cold containment stasis tanks are sufficient for juveniles, but some of the larger Metroids have been moved into quarantine caves for safety procedures. Security doors remain an issue as malfunctions due to ice occur every day. Large predators in the wastes are also a concern as they continue to kill personnel and breach secure areas. Unfortunately, it has become clear that our containment teams cannot neutralize all of them without a vast increase in munitions and soldiers. Teacher samples from stasis tanks must be hand carried to Lab Hydra for analysis. Notify security for all material stuff. Daily decontamination is now required of all personnel in the lab aether. More lore. Our initial tests exposing Talon 4's indigenous parasites to Phazon appear to be successful. Increase in strength, size, and aggressiveness are common in all test objects, as well as unforeseen evolutions like additional poison sacs within the abdomen and the appearance of a second ring of mandibles in several subjects. These creatures were chosen because of their resilience and it appears possible that, given enough exposure to Phazon, they may one day be able to survive on any planet we transport them to. Our methods will have to be refined. We currently have a 100% extinction rate after the fourth infusion period, and most survivors of the third infusion stage are so violent and uncontrollable they have to be euthanized. Even still, we remain hopeful that further experimentation will result in success. Yay! Actually, wait. Nope. <clears throat> Wrong button. So, if I pr go... Up is the direction that they want me to go. At this moment. In time. Here. Now. But to that I say nay. Just massive absorption capacity and flux. Strain replication is now underway. Transfer a special uh, 344. Further infusion. Suspended pending assessment. And who knew that all these pirates were so good with like Freaking genetics. Well, I say genetics, but they're kind of more or less just pushing a bunch of creatures into the ever so lovely. Oh, this one. They're pretty much just pushing individuals into phase on and going, yeah, I think that'll work. I think it made a noise. How much more is there to scan? Decrease vital science, cold damping at pure stable. Pulse at 140%, mass increase of 4. Yep. Pirate data. We've codified the new found energy sources phase on a V index mutagen of which we have very little reliable data. Indications point to a meteor of unknown origin impacting approximately 20 years ago, expelling Phazon into the environment. This material appears to possess lifelike characteristics, mutating organic life forms strong enough to withstand its poison. These mutations appear promising, with, a, with abrupt evolutionary leaps appearing in single generational or generation reproduction. Plans to establish a, a full science team on Talon 4 are being finalized. Mining operations have begun near the crater where Phazon appears to be most concentrated. Daily Phazon yields have increased 44% and our mining system becomes more streamlined as personnel and equipment flows increase. Several incidents of Phazon-induced madness have become been reported, prompting augmented life support regulations in the deeper chambers. Yeah, you can't read for a second there. Symptoms include loss of equilibrium, erratic respiration, Muscle spasms in the most extreme cases, cases, hallucinations. A timeline reassessment for the refinery operation is recommended as the material proves more unstable than initial analysis indicated. No wonder. Xenomes S.A. is undergoing relocation to Lab Hydra. Subjects transfer ordered after a pronounced increase in apparent... Behavior security increase ADR 13. 
phase of non-fusion with cer central energy car of Xenom SA is at 60% oh god that sounds bad most terraforming and retrofitting of security checkpoints on Talon 4 is complete but we continue to research the alarming epidemic of breaches by local creatures door records show no unauthorized entry so we must presume the creatures are either slipping in undetected through daily personnel moves or else finding their way in through subterranean tunnels. We have found many small breaches of this latter sort and plugged them wherever we can, but it is unlikely that we will ever achieve full extermination within our current timeline. Lore. Upper status tanks online, phase on drip line secure. And then, okay. Sweet, sweet lore. So I want to say it was this one that was connected to the one directly above. How would one open it? Or maybe that's something I have to... Actually, wait. I blasted the last one, didn't I? Yeah, thought so. Oh. No? Alright. One more for good measure. Hmm. Curiouser, curiouser. Seriously though, who knew that space pirates had just kind of had a thing for, uh, you know, freaking genetic m manipulation and the like. Things that all honestly threw me off when I first played this way back when too is like, what? Wait, I see you. Sucker! Oh. Jerk. I say as the individual that is blasting it. I'm glad that they constructed those with the sheer... Whoop, hello. Okay, one good thing. The charge shot of... Wave Beam... actually stuns them long enough that they become less of a problem. like dodge this. Oh wait, you can't because you're stunned. God, I hear this goddamn stuff all over the freaking place and I really want it. Give me stuff. There's a lot of lore to be found in here too, isn't there? Oh, God damn it. Phase on mining is underway. Several garrisons have been established. The terraforming of the Chozo Ruins is underway. I like saying underway. Security systems are operational, and science team continues to make progress in their biotech research. The Fendrana drifts have proven to be optional, optimal location and search room. Soon will be joined by a fully operational combat base and starport. That's bad. If command's predictions are half true, we have. We shall rise to dominance in this sector with the Deca cycle. So ten years? Truly, these are glorious times. Sure they are. Map coordinated data has been updated. Hey, cool. More lore. More lore. More lore. Scans of the spiral sector detected a massive energy spike emanating from wandering class planet identified as Talon 4. Scout res Reconnaissance was immediately dispatched to the center of the spike, a land mass at heading that, returning with planetary samples and atmospheric Im imaging. Analysis shows the energy source to be an unstable ra radioactive material of enormous potential. We are unable to form an accurate risk assessment at this time, 
but we are unlikely to find an energy source this powerful again. Analysis will continue, but currently, Talon 4 appears to be a viable secondary headquarters. Lockdown per security directive. Damn it. Of course, there's lore and stuff up there, too. Always the lore. Wait. Upper node of incense. Activate. And active. And holographic projector extensions are currently inactive and need to be manually rotated. Oh, that's what that's going to do, isn't it? Lower node of an astronomical holographic projector currently deactivated. Oh gee, I wonder what happens when you activate it. Hmm. Well, I want to get up there. So I guess I'll have to activate the thing. Activate thing. God, this better not be timed. Sorry, I thought I missed more lore. Alright. Yep, yeah, this is probably gonna be timed. Kinda wonder, how the hell do space pirates use any of these things that require the ball? Okay. Man, as a dude that gets headaches easily from heavy bass sounds, I do not appreciate the sound of those pistons. Not that, like I said, it's not that long of a charge cycle, so it's not like, oh, I gotta spend three seconds charging. Nah, it's like a second of holding down the button at most. Okay, you gotta admit, that's hacking pretty. Look at this thing. That's the solar system that Samus resides in, I guess. A long time ago in a galaxy far, far someplace. How do I get up? There's no platform. Planet Twin Tabula known for twin fevers, a disease caused by viral strain native to twin tabula. Early stages of this disease, victims suffer from double vision. When the twin sight faded, the victim is near death. Well. Research indicator. Oh, that's Talon 4. Ecosystem studies indicate that Talon 4 was a biological paradise prior to the impact of an extraterrestrial object, where remains of the biosphere is slowly fading due to exposure to phazon radiation. At current rate of decay, Talon 4 will be a barren Class 8 wasteland in approximately 25 years. That's not depressing. That's not what I was scanning, but okay. Ah, Zips. Planet's crust is primarily earthic ore, making it ideal for subterranean construction. Class, what was that? 19 planet? Zips is inhospitable to most bioforms. The world was considered unremarkable until it became the base for space pirate forces. Even then, it was still pretty unremarkable. <laughs> Wait, is that it? Oh, there's one more. Ore Mine 2. Uninhabitable wasteland salvaged by, salvaged by nuclear dust storms and constant seismic upheavals. 
So, anyone that knows Metroid lore and whatnot, um, do you visit some of these other places? Like in later games or whatnot? Wait. Okay, I saw all the pipes on the wall. It's like, wait, is that how I go through this thing? Or do I just... I, yes, I constantly freaking don't know how far a jump is. Sue me. Alright, can I grab this? Yay! Powerful attack uses five missiles using a power beam. Press and hold B A to charge, then Y to fire. Oh, that's all well and good, but I want to go that way first because I think that's a save point. Hello, save point. And I'm going to go ahead and call an episode here. What a good way to end an episode with super missiles. Super missile, get. Thank you everyone so very much for watching. When we return, we're going to go to that place that was pointed out to us by the game and be all like, hey, pirates, stop it. Yeah. Thank you everyone so very much for watching. I hope you guys are enjoying the series as much as I'm enjoying playing it. And as always, I hope to see you guys in the next video. Take care. Cheers. Helps if I pause. <laughs>